Hello, folks. Welcome back. I am the one, the only. I am Hobo Tom. And you know, as you can see, I'm dressed very casually. A little bit of red in the cheek. I have a little bit extra scruff going. Because it's, it's been the coronavirus, as you probably can figure out by now. Unless you're living in Maine, Nebraska, Iowa, Wyoming, or Idaho. Those five states do not seem to be affected by the coronavirus. I just chose the wrong state to live in. But a better state. Hope everyone is doing well out there. And I wanted to bring a little levity to this moment. In the fact that so many people make top ten lists. I would make I would make my ten ten list. Cause we have no idea what's gonna happen on I think Monday, April thirteenth. There's a whole bunch of rumors and stuff swirling around the internet that after WrestleMania weekend uh, WWE's already taped their Raw. They've already done their SmackDown. After that, they're just going to cut it out and take a little break. So I wanted to bring a little levity. So that week I'll be making another video because, well, now Florida has just issued a um, stay-at-home policy. Daytona Beach is under a curfew now, too. Can't hobo. Jeez, I really do have to sign up for, for unemployment now. And they've been swamped. I think, like, in Florida alone, like a couple million people filed for unemployment. That's not good. And I don't know. I'm still hopeful that this clears up by Easter. I'll tell you what, them stores are going to be busy. Yeah, you can see I'm nice and casually dressed. I'm all set for my... Well, it's, it's Lent, so I can't even have a coronavirus party. Darn it. But here's my top 10 list of things to do, of things I've been doing during this whole coronavirus. Ready? Number one! Annoy my cat. You know what? Sometimes she's just there, lounging around close enough to me. And it's like, you know what? It's time to give her a little exercise. Grab one of her toys and just annoy her. Yes, here. One thing to do. See her. See how much you can annoy her. Sue Young! Uh-oh, there we go. See, if you annoy her enough, she will attack. So much as she likes up part. Hey, you're on camera.
Oh, mind you, this is a wrestling program, so there's going to be some wrestling involved. Number two. Search for female outlaw mud show backyard wrestling on YouTube. There is no finer source of entertainment than YouTube going on right now. Sometimes you get bored enough, you look for dogs and surfboards. I figured, hey, female outlaw mud show backyard wrestling what's better than that then on our next match uh was joey ryan from cancel culture against Cody Deer. this is all this all started last week when Joseph Ryan wanted to cancel Cody because it's comes towards Katie Forbes, but that didn't work out for Joseph as Cody Deer pulled out the victory. Uh, and just before we went to break, we saw Eddie backstage with Tessa. He thanked her for helping him in his next relationship and wanted to offer his help in case she needed it in her match against Ethan Cage later. Um, hmm. <clears throat> we'll see what happens because she did decline his offer. Let me introduce to you, I give you Liar. I am the bad bitch in this yard. Why do I think this is in, like, my hometown?
Number three. Hey, you know what? Since I can't live stream, I might as well watch others live stream. Thank you very much, Melissa Santos. You've always provided a source of entertainment for us. Thank you very much. Number four. You know what? There's no other sports going on. You might as well watch pro wrestling. Enough said. It is, but Tessa Blanchard comes into every match. She's done her homework. She knows what she's up against. And, and she knows what she brings to the table. I have to ask this question. This match got set up because of what happened in the very beginning of the show. It was Josh Alexander one-on-one -on -one with Eddie Edwards. Alexander won the match because Ethan Page got involved, and then they started the onslaught. They started to beat down Eddie Edwards. Tessa comes to the rescue, and she thwarts the North. Ethan now went on with Tessa. And then Tessa tells Eddie Edwards, I don't need your help. I don't need you out there. Was that a mistake? You know, Tessa doesn't make very many mistakes inside the ring. But outside the ring, in that situation where Eddie offered his support, oh. I think Tessa turning it down may have been a moment where ego got away for her. Here. What number was I at? Okay, so. Oh, yeah, that's right. Number five! You can be like this guy, Hobo Tom, and you can make your own wrestling videos, or you can make your own videos about professional wrestling. Take a look at what happens behind the scenes here at the Hobo Studio. Hello folks, welcome again, this is so weird, I'm like doing like multiple, I'm multitasking now, uh, mainly because I'm going to be making a top 10 list, I'll probably put that up late, I'll probably put it up Thursday, I'll be honest, probably Thursday night, it's going to be the top 10 things to do during this coronavirus thing, wow, I actually look pretty handsome for some reason, I do not know that, of course I'm 30 minutes, Wow. That's weird. It must be like lighting and stuff. I don't know. So yeah, you're going to kind of see me go back and forth and, and just to like see. Yep, there we go. You can see me. Yep, so as you're watching this, let's see here. Uh, this is going to be number five. Let's see, yeah, I'll put my hand there. Number five reason why or what to do during the coronavirus and that is make selfies of yourself making wrestling program oh wait that's right i do have a wrestling program to talk about so seriously i'll put you there 
And let's see here. I'll just do a couple more minutes of it. I won't be doing too much more. But see, these are my notes for Impact Wrestling. So right now, I'm going to be making my... Oh, wait. I have this recording already. Hello, everyone. A little sneak peek of what's going to happen. I have no idea how that's coming up. But this is what's going to happen later this week. I'm making a top 10 list I do during coronavirus 2020. And this made number 5. 5. 5. Number 6. You know what? It never hurts to play a good video game. One of my preferred video games that's been taking me a while to play is The Witcher 3 Wild Hunt. You know what? It's actually challenging. Most parts are doable at certain levels. And hey, you can have your character have lots of the sex. So again, you can always play video games. You're staying at home, minding your own business. You're not infecting others with, with your coughs or other contagions. So on this one, you have seven minutes, so that's okay. Nope, this button, there we go. Let's sneeze. Is this amusing? Do I entertain you? Are you not entertained? Oh, there we go. Video game time. And this is my list of things to do. Skip that. Skip that. Uh, continue. The curse that held him by fruit hard to lift. But Yennefer and yep. Richards managed to do it. The obvious man alive revealed himself to be not man, but elf. And an elven sage at that. Amalak, for this was his name, was the elven mage who had helped Ciri flee the hunt. Then hidden her away on the Isle of Mist. You don't do that tomorrow. Just upload, upload this stuff to the computer. I killed. There we go. Asking up some sort of PETA. Do it this way. So here I am playing video game. See, so I wonder if there's some easy monster I can just like. It's not going to necessarily kill me yet. So again, I have to go to this place. There's a mini map. Dear. Well, I don't go there. I don't want to kill myself yet. Oh, to go over here. Holy crap, I have to like focus now. Yep, so it's me playing video games. Oh wow. Let's see if I can just... Okay, so I have to rethink that. Number seven! You know what some good news is in all this stuff? The liquor stores are still open. Very important source of entertainment for most people. Even though right now it's Lent and I'm gone dry. 
for a while, almost 40 days now. I was not able to have a, a coronavirus party. Darn it. But again, other people were able to. That's good. was liquor store still open. Kind of see a little bit. Yep, liquor store still open. Always go look. Always go liquor shopping. <laughs> Number eight. Guess what other store is still going to be open? Walmart! Yeah, so you can still go to Walmart, enjoy your shopping experience. Uh, you'll, you'll see people dress rather oddly. What can you say about it? It's just Walmart.
Nein! 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 You know what? It's been recommended by everyone that you do some kind of exercise. Over at Kanishan, she shows us how she walks around her neighborhood. She's in her backyard. Even in my own gym, actually has their own Facebook page dedicated to home exercise. And now there's countless others doing the same thing on YouTube. Wait a second. I'm going to show you my exercise. I have a little pitchback machine. And for baseball, got to loosen up the old shoulder. It's a little tight. Uh, yeah, a little tight. That's okay. So it's a good exercise. I get out. My cat gets to go outside with me. She gets to sit in the grass, stare at the birds. I get some exercise in. If not, just like Scott Steiner says, you might become a fat piece of shit. So don't become an FPOS. Go outside and get some exercising in. Oh, okay. So there's cheese pot. Hello, folks. Welcome to my backyard. Since this is the only place I'm allowed to be, this is going to be part of my video. Ten things to do during coronavirus. See her. One of the fun things I have. Probably see it right over there. This is number nine. See her. Play catch. I wonder how this. Oh, that sucked. I have no. Sorry, sorry for double takes. I just suck. Actually, my arm is going to right now. Because this is all the ex like, literally all the exercise that I've been getting for a while. Where'd my cat go? Which side of the fence is she on? Okay, she's on the good side of the fence. Keep an eye on her, because she will. Explore stuff and roll around in the dirt. There we go. Let's see here. Such a gimmick setup I have. It's, uh, literally being held together with like duct tape. I think. I'm not going to do 13 minutes of this, I know that much. And I'll just upload this to the computer. Again, a little exercise is better than no exercise, I guess. Knuckleball action. So your mind pitches, so there was knuckleball. Two seam. Actually, wait, that's the two seam right there. Four seam. Let's see here, the Quay are special. Circle change. Oh, I think she's gonna jump the fence. I think we go get her soon. Oop, there we go. Curve. Palm. Slider. Okay. Oh, well, that's it. Take just a couple more tosses. And I think the only other thing that keeps me going. Let's see here. I think she snuck out. Jeez. 
Jeez, Pa, what are you doing? Back into your own yard. No, not that yard. No, keep on going. No, you know where your yard is. Get, get in. Sneaky kitty cat. And that's my exercise. Bye. And 10, 10, 10, 10. One of my favorite activities of all time, I went fishing. Yes, while everyone else is terrified that the economy is going to collapse, society is going to collapse, Walmart's going to close, liquor stores will still be open, but most people can't survive on booze alone. However, I have the necessary survival skills to go fishing and just like this video shows, I will be eating because I know how to catch my own meals. Very important skill, fishing, self-survivorship. And that's my top 10 list of things I'm doing during the coronavirus. Um, again, probably in a couple of weeks or probably after next week because they're still wrestling next week. But then after that, besides Impact Wrestling and AEW's not even too sure what they're going to be doing, I'll at least be able to put a video about what this guy, Hobo Tom, was doing during the stay-at-home order. Everyone else... Be safe. Do not pass any contagions on to others. Uh, like, share, comment, subscribe. See you later. Bye. It's time to cook the.